Pisces, I keep hearing I've got a newborn identity or a newborn child in my hands and I've got something in the palm of my hands like China. You could be from China. China, China. My old China, I've got it in my hands. It's mine, okay? It's not yours, it's mine. It's not yours, it's mine. Okay, so I don't know what that is. Someone fighting over children again. Jen, Julian, Jason, Justin, Jackie, Jasmine. If y'all got anything to do with a number eight when I was doing the last reading, which it came up as Aquarius... Um, sorry, I just realised I was supposed to be doing Capricorn. I forgot. I'm doing Pisces now. Sorry, I'll have to do Capricorn next. I just realised. Hold on a minute. Uh, I think I missed Capricorn because I've done Aquarius this morning. Um, yeah, I should have done Capricorn. Sorry, I'm just realising. Anyway, we'll do Pisces first. Um, yeah, they're saying, well, there might be a reason because of that. Like They're saying, well, there's a reason because of that. Um... Reese, I'm hearing Reese or Rihanna, Pisces, like Rihanna, Anna, Pollyanna, Anne, my nan, something to do with around your nan, like my nan this, my nan that, my grandma this, my grandma that, my nan this, my nan. Some of you got a very good grandma, is what I'm hearing. Grandma, we love you, grandma. Um, but I definitely give you like a baby grand, like a grand or a thousand pound, or to be grand, like it's grand, it's from Ireland, but like. Uh, it's a grand, it's a baby grand, okay? So a baby grand is like a piano. So you might be doing like I do, like a synthesizers, pianos, guitars, mixing, mastering, angel radio, so on and so forth like that. And it'll be a grand piano, okay? Or a grand entrance. Like I'm going to make a grand entrance and in I come. So like you're just coming all over someone or you're just coming together. Came up for an Aquarius slash Leo and we're going to come together. You come first. Or like, I'll beat you. You come and then I come and then like, we might as well come together. So some of you are banging one out and knocking one out and coming together. Some of you, it's coming together quite nicely. Or the name Lee or Leanne or Lisa or Lulu. Okay, and it's coming together quite nicely. This plan, it's a little bit like, uh, what was it? Uh, I love it when a plan comes together. Okay, so I love it when we come together. At the end of the day, I end it there. I'm hearing someone from up north. At the end it there, I love it when we come together. So some of you, like, you come together at the end of the day and you meet up with your partner or you talk to them and stuff like that. I'm also hearing meat. Some of you might be a meat eater or a carnivore or something like that or a carnival. Some sort of, like, carnival that, that might be coming up. Came up in uh, the last reading around an event, like an event horizon. So you can be dealing with, like, rising up, cook a, a cookie or, like, a... Um, uh, rising up, back on my feet, somewhere around Leo or an Aquarian, and we seem to be rising up, or like your stomach seems to be rising, like I don't know, someone could be pregnant or something like that, and it seems to be rising nicely, like doing a lot of cooking and baking and like putting, kneading it and doughing it, and it's coming together nicely. Some of you, you're mixing and mastering, and you're doing things around music, and it seems to be mixing quite well, and like I'm mastering it quite well. I'm like a master of none. So, uh, but like uh, I'm I'm mastering something, okay, or I'm going for a master's degree or Fahrenheit, something around a Sagittarius or a Taurus. It seems to be coming together quite nicely, okay. I'm going for a master's degree or something that is rising up, like I'm rising up and I'm now back on my feet and I feel like I'm ready for the world and I'm ready now, like is what I'm hearing. Like it's like um, something that's in the oven and it goes ding or like bing like a phone it goes right i'm ready now and you're like oh are you ready you're ready or not here i come not if i say not you say whoosh, pisces hanging from a tree jesus so something to do around um i'm ready are you ready yeah no i'm ready if you're ready okay so then let's talk now then okay so it's a bit like at the end of the day when you're finished work or something you look forward to i don't know sitting down cooking your now they're saying cookie monster or something like that on my monster or Something like so you, some of you are drinking a shitload of monsters and stuff like that. Or like um, like you sit down and it goes ding. And you're like, right, are you ready now? And like, yeah, no, I'm ready to call now. So call now. Hey now, hey now, don't dream it's over. Hey now, hey now, there's a world between us. You know they won't win. So world between us, which will be a three, which will be a Pisces, is in between us. So that might be another Piscean energy somewhere, or there's a lot of Pisces up in here, a lot of three energies, life path three, Pisces, family, daughter, sister, her name's twisted sister. Some of you got a twisted sister that's a Pisces, or a twisted brother-in-law, or Laura, Lucy, Lucifer, Capricorn, are like twisted, like you seem to be twisted. 
Okay, so what is that, an eight? Leo or an Aquarian? And you seem to be twisted. Like I seem to be twisting your arm. Okay, so someone keeps asking for someone saying, look, you know, I'm going to twist your arm. You go, I don't know what that's for. Twist your arm. Can I twist your arm and can I get you to indulge in this, madam? I mean, someone work in a shop and they're like, hello, madam, come in. Can I just twist your arm in order to buy this? Something like that. Twist your arm. I don't know what that's for. Someone keeps twisting someone's arm and they're like, ah, that really hurts. So I don't know what that is. Twist my arm. Uh, you twisted my arm or you broke my arm. Really? Someone broke their arm? Broke my arm. Forces. The armed forces. Something to do with the armed force. Luke Skywalker or Luke in the book and you twisted my arm. Someone, someone knows how to get what they want by twisting someone's arm. Okay, they, they, they kind of like, they play downtrodden or something in order to get what they want. You're like, they give you like the puppy dog look or something like, and they're like, oh, go on. And you're like, oh, go on then. Okay, go on then. Oh, okay, go on then. I mean, is it a child? And they're like, oh, please. And you're like, oh, go on then. You're like, oh, please. Can you? You're like, oh, go on then. Oh, please. Oh, go on then. Like, I'm sucker for punishment kind of thing, or punishment. I mean, is there violence here, like punishment? Like, I'm going to punish you for it. The Punisher? Something to do with Marvel? Marvel Teen, Tina? Marvel Teen? Like, punish for glut glutton for punishment. Gluttony. So, um, well, I'm seeing nine. So, like, seven deadly sins. You could be dealing with a seven, life path seven, or a Cancerian, and a glutton for punishment, like gluttony, greed. Like the seven deadly sins, like sinning. Some of you might be on the slimming world diet, like myself, okay, and sins. Or like, unless all of you are all church, religious type for, sort of folk, I'm like, I'm going to have to go and confess to the church and confess. Oh, really? This is that person again. Some of you are like, confession, like, conf hey, we need to confess. We have a church, we have a clergy, and I'm going to confess. Oh, really, Jesus? Fess up, fess up. Fess up, fess up, fess up, for sale. Steve, Sarah, Sal, Sally, fess up. I'm going to have to fess up and tell you something. Cough it up, like cough it up, cough it up. Well, cough it up normally means, right, you owe me some money. Go on, cough it up, right? What do you owe? You're like, well, I owe you some money. Like, yeah, cough it up then. So I don't know what that is, like fessing up or coughing up to something. And I'm going to have to fess up soon. I'm going to have to say something soon because if I don't, okay. So it's kind of like this, like I'm holding this in and I'm trying not to. But soon I'm going to have to confess something and tell you something about me that may be very important. Like I'm going to have to confess. It might be church and you guys that go there. But like they keep saying like I'm going to have to confess. Fess up, fess up. Sup, 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 G, sup, G, sup, oh, God, this is, oh, Jesus, what's up, G, what's up, G, what's up, G, G, Anna, G, Jason, Julian, just, just, what's up, just, Libra, what's up, just, Libra, what's up, G, everybody, G, everybody in the ass, everybody in the place, what's up, G, what's up, G, J, 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 someone's all like, all that lingo, that brave, innit, like, yeah, Tyrone, you know, Sam Brown, it's all G, that bit it. It's all a bit of this, it's all a bit of that, but it's all G. It's all G, G. <laughs> Why do people talk like that? <laughs> well, it's obviously where you're from, right? But like, uh, yeah, it's all G, dap, innit? It's all G. 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 Thelma and Louise, Louisiana, Paul. It's up, G. It's up, G. <laughs> what the fuck is that? G, G. Gianna, Jason, like, G, G. Like, giddy up, Gigi. Silver's pussy. Giddy up, Gigi. <laughs> giddy up, G. Giddy up, G. Giddy up, G. Giddy up, G. Get all up and then own it. I mean, is it Scottish? Get it up, me G, or all. <laughs> Get it up, me G. Just put it in me arsehole. Get it all up in me ring. Get it all up in me ring. <laughs> give us a ring, then. Yeah, go on, give us a ring. Oh, it's all G up and around me ring. Oh, oh I'm a leprechaun. <laughs> I mean, is this like, what's his name, gold member? Is that, like, oh, I'm a leprechaun. Get all up in there in that. <laughs> like, oh, get all up in there in that ring all. Ring all. Get up all in there in me ring all. 
Like, ring me up and I'll get all up in a ring, your ring. <laughs> I'll give you a ring. Some Oh, someone could be giving someone a ring in seven days. So for all the people, I do apologise that lost a person called Steve here, because that freaked me out because my name is Steve. Seven days, I'm going to give you a ring. Someone might be getting proposed or give someone a proposal in seven days or pick up a pen, 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 pick up a pen. In seven days, I'm going to pick up a pen, <laughs> like, or a penguin of food. Like, I might eat some chocolate in seven days. Or I might, like, uh, get engaged in seven days. Or I'm going to give you a ring in seven days. Now, that ring could also be... Because uh, that's what I based my channel off, because I'm going to have seven. So it's really to do with uh, the ring and also seven, which was the film seven, which was the seven deadly sins and gluttony and greed and everything else. So I don't know what this is around seven days for simply coming up again. Like, give us a ring in seven days. Like, give us a call in seven days time. Seven days time. So listen to what Steve said. Steve said it in seven days. Well, I did. I used to do a set of videos about two years ago that were called Seven Days Time. I did. 11.11 11 on the clock, just as I looked up. Uh, I used to do them. What's going to happen in seven days' time? And I pretty much started that when I bought the Vice Versa deck. Okay. Uh, like past, present, future. What's going to happen in seven days? The seven days keeps coming up. Seven days. Seven days of... Seven. So seven is very important. Well, that's me. Because <laughs> I'm a pie thief. Like, Life Path 7, 7, 7, 7. Like, Lucky Number 7. Lucky Lucy Laura. Lucifer Capricorn. Lucky. Lucky. Like, I seem to be lucky. I mean, if someone gambling and you pray those noughts and crosses and then 777 seven, seven comes in, you're like, woohoo! I've hit the jackpot. Okay. Or crackpot. Jack. Jackie Julian. Jack. I seem to have hit the jackpot. Some of you might be gambling some money or a scratch card or something. Okay, and you win some money or you get some money or give someone some money in like seven days time, you end up receiving some sort of like payoff or something like some of you might be like you find out in like financial information and you find it out in seven days time. You find out like some news that's very good news and you find it out uh, in seven days time, like some sort of financial type sort of thing that may be like took into the grave. We, we come up with this before something that got took to the grave. Um, and like you find out this information, uh, and it's very good news. It's not bad news. It's very good news. Um, is what I'm hearing. Like some sort of celebrating energy. Like we're going to celebrate in seven days time. Okay. Time, you can go to Downsport, someone from Australia or Bruce. We're going to find, going to find you, make you want me. Oh, that was racism again. So, sorry, there is, um, like, I'm going to make you want me. I'm going to make you want me. I'm going to make you something and give you it in seven days time. So it might be a gift or something that comes pre-packed or prepared and it comes in seven days time. Because it could be a proposal or it could be an offer of something like I'm going to put in an offer. Okay. Or so it could be something that's coming towards you. I don't know. Because I'm around a car. Like I'm going to put an offer in for a car or like I'm going to go to an auction yard and I'm going to put an offer in on a house or a business or a home. And I'm going to like do that in seven days time. It will be like an evaluation. Okay, we're going to have something appraised like a ring and I'm going to have it engraved like an engraved headstone or an engraved ring. Okay, or I'm going to engrave something. Okay, it might be a grave site or a grave stone or like visit a grave site, but they keep saying like an engraving, like a stone, like a silver. Oh, silver. <laughs> Silver's buzzy. But like a, 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 a ruby or a like a diamond, like diamonds are forever. Ruby, uh, not ruby wax. Um, uh, Shirley, Bassy, Bassets. Someone has a beagle or a bagel. Well, it's Jewish. I don't know. But like, um, it's around a Pisces. And I'm going to have something engraved, like a watch or a, 
I don't know. I keep saying like an engraving, like I'm going to have like something like a, a stone that's going to be like made and I'm going to have it made especially for you. Especially for you. Someone could be getting married in an opposal here. Okay. And um, like I'm going to have this ring like engraved for you. Like you really could be dealing with like a four, like a life path four or Scorpio. Okay. And I'm going to have it engraved. Okay. And it's going to be especially for you. It's going to have your name on it. So it's a tag. Or a, it's going to have your name on it. Like it's like a business. Or like like I'm going to make something for you. And it's going to have your name on it. Like seven tarot or something. Like seven. And I'm going to engrave it. And I'm going to give you it as a present or a gift. But it's an engraving gravy gravy train boat gravy boat a boat six capricorn gemini and i'm going to have something engraved and then i'm going to give you it as a gift like a watch or something like that and i'm going to have it engraved and give you it as a gift so is it for a birthday like for someone's birthday or something and i'm going to buy like a special gift and i'm going to have it engraved it might be a ring a diamond or Something like that, and uh, I'm going to propose to you, and something like that. Or I'm going to tell you something that's really important in seven days' time, and it might be around like relationship sort of stuff. Like I'm soon going to tell you something. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Lucy, Laura, Lulu, Lucifer, Capricorn, Six, Gemini. Um, let's see, because it's like something that you may have like evaluated, like you go into a porn shop or something, right, or porn movie or something. I don't know. I'll show someone a movie, but like, um, like it's like a great reveal. Like, come in and we're going to have it appraised and we're going to have it looked at. How much is that worth? Or like our house and come into the house and we're going to have it looked at and they're going to tell me how much the house is worth and then we can decide whether we're going to sell it or keep it or rent it or something like that or you might be moving physically and they say okay you can visit this house in like seven days time and blah 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 and we're going to praise you for it like church or something and we're going to praise you so it might be like a funeral even that you've got to go to in like seven days time okay but we're going to have it appraised and we're going to have it looked at and see how much it's worth and then we can decide what to do with it this sounds a hell of a lot like my friend chris um yeah that's what they're saying okay so let's see uh pisces you all right guys how you doing so uh if you don't know anything about how i read channel numbers they're all provided in playlists and all set out for you below that are free okay so let's see so pisces what have you got coming up this week pisces pisces for the win oh yes win 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 I'm going I can't lose is what I'm hearing like I can't lose I'm I'm just on a lucky streak like I just feel like I am just lucky to be around you I'm lucky to be with you and I want to be with you alchemy and you Natalie but like I'm lucky to be around you I'm lucky to be here and I'm lucky that you're my partner is what I'm hearing my partner in crime Paolo Nettini Paula Penta but I'm lucky to be here I'm grateful to be here I'm grateful that you're with me on this. I'm grateful that you agree. Okay. I'm grateful. Just grateful is what I'm hearing. I'm really grateful for where I am in life. I'm really grateful for the person that has been blessed to be given me. Okay. I am blessed with a child, a grandchild, a thousand pounds, a gift, but I feel very blessed. So I'm hearing. Okay. Blessed B. There's a name B. Something like that. I'm also hearing someone like a grandchild or a child being christened. And they go for a blessing. Like, or a christening or something like that. And we're going to be, the baby's going to be christened and blessed as like junior or something like that. Or the father's name or whatnot gets passed down as like, some people do this, but Roman Egyptians normally do this. Like, not everybody, but a lot of Roman Egyptians here where we are, um... They like they pass their 
like their heritage is really important to them. So if someone's called Ed, they'll be called Edward Jr. or something like that, or Dave, Dave Jr., right? Or something like that. And I keep hearing like Kubin Gordon Jr. or something like that. Oh, child, things are going to be brighter. Oh, child. So it's kind of like this energy of like um, someone passing down their name, which is like marriage. And it is also like, I'm going to give you my name, like my full name or full name and address, or I'm, you know, I'm blessed to be able to have your name as my surname kind of thing, <clears throat> or like a child that's being christened to say that, you know, this is now your christening and you are going to be named after my father. Like I'm going to name you after my father. Okay. Something like that. Okay. Let's see. So Pisces, 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 Pisces. What they got coming up this week for the tarot, please? Pisces and my little fish too. Two, two, two. Bonnie McGrew, can I have a dick, please, Bob? <laughs> Are you bobbing for apples? I'm just waiting for you to just get your dick out. <laughs> What's that dick here? Yeah, some of you could be Romany Gypsy. Dick here, Chavy Mush. Dick and a Chavy. Dick and a Chavy Mush. Oh, dick at him. Oh, dig at the Chavis chocolates, bruv. Can you rock and roll me? Can you cover pie? Can you talk chicken with a mushroom jelly bite? Oh, dig at the Chavis. Look, dig at his dig, dig at the size of his wand, Harry. So you're like, well, I'm just waiting for a wand, that's all. <laughs> Wanda, a fish called Wanda. I just keep wandering about Ronda Rousey, or I'm always aroused all the time. Like, it's what I keep hearing, like, why am I always aroused when I'm around you? Like, or Andrew, or Andrea. Like, why am I always seem to get aroused? <laughs> this is like at the most inconvenient moment. Ooh, child. It's like, ooh, typhoon. Something to do with your mother, your brother, your sister. Some of you are heading to get married. Mm. Some of you got friends. Friends will be friends. When you need a love to give me care and attention. Some of you are a care worker and you work for the elderly. And you're a care worker. Okay, some of you light workers, I'm real light workers. Bruv, I ain't no light worker. Don't come around here with that light working bollocks. I am a dark worker. That's where I do all my work. In the dark. Scorpio rising, North Node, 12th house. <laughs> well, like, uh, um, light codes is what I'm hearing. Like codes, Cody, Codeine, Codeine. Some of you are like Codeine Linktus or Codeine Tablets. Cody, Brody, Bridey, Brian. Uh, the Life of Brian, some of you are Jewish. Uh, but uh, like codeine linked us and stuff like medication of codeine some sort of painkiller at the painkiller cycle on my bicycle michael i'm also here, michael bicycle some of you are bicycle bicycle i want to ride your bicycle i want to ride my bike i want to ride my bicycle i can ride you wherever i like I said, back. I said, what? I said, oh, okay. Yeah, there's definitely some sort of like energy here again. Um, but yeah, some sort of, um, I want to ride you. <laughs> I want to ride on the donkey. Somebody's blessed with a donkey. Look at them, bless them. They've got a donkey in their pocket. <laughs> is, are you just pleased to see me or is that a donkey in your pocket? Bro, that's no donkey. Donkey built like Donkey Kong is what I'm hearing. Donkey Kong. King Kong, King Kong, <laughs> me Tarzan, you Jane, <laughs> you come with me, that's <laughs> all so like Tarzan, Tarzan, <laughs> so I was like, <laughs> it came up with a like laugh, so <laughs> well, Jim will fix it used to do that, and we really don't want to talk about Jim will fix it, um, some of you are smoking copious amounts of ganja again, I can see that one, because this is, I don't smoke that either. Some of you have given up the reefer. Like, I've given up the reefer. <laughs> I don't smoke the reefer. What's that, cats? <laughs> the howling wolf. Silver's pussy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you've been where no man has been before. It's all right, sweetheart. It's only a wand. Don't you worry, fish called Wanda. 
I wonder, I wonder, where that fish is gone. Where's that fish been? <laughs> Where's that fish been? It's been around the market. <laughs> that fish been, that fish has been around the market. Some of you might be from Boongate or London and you might do a lot of fish. Like eating a lot of fish, cooking a lot of fish. Like fish and chips or like, I don't know, like fish. Yeah, sweetheart, come in. Yeah, we've got comp, we've got addict, we've got place. Some of you work at the place, no res residential, resident evil. What's I'm hearing that? Resident evil? Some of you have evil Knievel. Some sort of like motorbike accident or some kind of pain in the back. Like, I don't know, like I seem to be in pain because of an accident. Like, someone could have had an accident a long time ago and it's put them in pain. Or in Spain, like it's, I might go back to Spain. Um, uh, oh, Pisces, 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 they're coming at you. I'm coming to get you, ready or not, ready or not. If I say not, you say Pisces. Well, ready or not, I'm ready if you are. Are you ready? Yeah, no, what, can we speak now? Yeah. Okay, so you're ready then? Yeah, I'm ready when you are, sweetheart. Smoke me a kipper and I'll be back for breakfast. And this is the big breakfast. And Johnny Vaughan and Denise. Denise Van Elton. Elton John. Elton John. Uh, Elton Ben Elton. And also someone's someone's like a com like comedy. Like, fu like funny stuff. Divine comedy. Divine living in the UK. Comedy. Like comedy. Divine comedy. Um... But, like, it's very funny. Very funny. <laughs> you come to the right place! <laughs> Divine comedy. Oh, dear. So, the loss of the loved one. Okay, we said that Steve in seven days. Divine living in the UK. He was a Pisces and it was also called Steve, right? There you go. Steve Wright. What's there in, like, a radio? Angel radio, maybe? But, like, Steve Wright in the afternoon. That's actually on our radio, British. Steve Wright in the afternoon. Steve Wright, and this is called Steve Wright, or Steve Bright, or Steve Bright Eyes Burning Like Fire, or it could be a Chris, uh, it could be a awake, is what I'm also hearing, like a, you know, a, uh, what you call cremation, um, bright eyes burn, look at the right setting, look at the line, the line so brightly, Never saw them so pale, bright eyes. Someone's got really bright eyes. Bright. Someone's very bright, like emotionally intelligent or very intelligent. Bright. Bright. You're always right, ain't you? You're always right. If you're right, you're right. You're right. Are you right? Yeah, no, I'm right. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Good. As long as you're all right. <laughs> It's like a conversation. Like, you all right? They're like, yeah, I'm all right. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Ah, we're all right then. Yeah. Oh, I see you're right. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm all right. Oh, okay. Um, What have you done today? I don't know. You tell me what you've done. You're like, Okay, well, uh, <laughs> so it's like this conversation, like, are you right? Yeah, no, I'm all right. Are you all right? Yeah, no, I'm all right, Harry. Harry, Prince Harry. Oh, dude, that's coming up. Prince Harry, something to do with the children. Uh, that's a load of bullshit. <laughs> uh, let's see, fives, Taurus, Sagittarian. Could be a friend that you're helping out, Pisces. There's a Taurus. Okay. Uh, three of Swords. Damn, the same card in the same position as the last time, Pisces. For the last time, wherever I saw your face. For the last time, I ever saw your face. Someone's going to get drunk up in there like, listen, this is the last time I'm ever going to see you again, Jen. It's the last time. For the last time and for the last of us, and it's Rob Zombie. Or Zombie. It's the last time I'm going to see you again. Someone could be like, I don't know, grieving here and drinking. It's no, I, I didn't mean to do that. I just called to say I love you. I just called to say how much I care. I do. 
as is called to, to say love you and I mean it from the bottom of my heart oh <laughs> some of you this is family this is your brother your sister your sibling it could have a placement of Taurus situ Sagittarius could be a friend and it's painful in order to see the amount of grief that they're going through of where it's just they kind of keep doing it to themselves all over and over again like I said when I'm doing a you versus them do not fuck up your relationship if it's going well may not be anything to do with it okay you versus them meaning you versus the people that challenge you <laughs> the most that annoy you the most that need help the most okay but um let's see show me the other person connected to pisces please the other person connected to pisces because there's a lot of div don't dilly dally on the way seven life path seven cancerian something to do with your car may need fixing jim will fix it really man there's child abuse here i don't know where that's coming from child abuse i'll fix it can you fix it look can you do this or can't you do it someone might be trying to fix your car but they might not be fixing it fix it look, i'll try and fix you I'm going to fix you, whether you need it or not, I'm going to fix you. Someone's like into asphyxiation, like likes to be strangled or something. Oh. Okay, this suicide watch here again, like I'm having to watch and keep a close eye on you because of your state of mind. Here. Watch. And then grave, dig grave digger. What's that? Dig up a grave. Graves. Grave. Grave digger. Um something to do with graves like a grieving the loss of a loved one and going to a grave site and or helping someone through the grief and the like i'm helping you through this and i'm trying to pull you through it I'm trying to pull you through the other end to get you to focus on this energy like i've given my friend a job to do because he's really suffering through the loss of his father a long time ago and his mother and he's really struggling bless him so i'm there to help taurus Okay, one of my best friends ever. Sold him, I will do anything for you and you'll never be alone. And no matter what you're going through, I will never, ever, ever see you go without. Ever will I ever see you go without. If you need me, I'm here for anything that you ever need. Okay, and then getting someone to focus... To focus on something here is momentum forward, okay? I'm going to give you something to do to focus on other than the grief and the loss, okay? I've said this for a very long time. When there's grief and there's loss and there's a lot of down feelings and downtrodden and everything else, the only thing that you have in your life is to focus on the future, not the past, okay? So the more you can focus on a bright future you'll start seeing the bright side of life when you have purpose. Have to have a pursuit of happiness of purpose. When you've got one and it's good, it's normally a thing. Me, maybe. <laughs> if I say thing, you say Stephen King or Leo or an Aquarian, right? But like focus is something like, okay, there's a lot going on in my life. There's a lot going on in my mind. What do I do to help this person the most? Give them something to focus on that is going to give them purpose. My pursuit of happiness is to do what I love and I enjoy. If you're really struggling financially, physically, and mentally, and emotionally, then what I can do is stick a chariot in you. <laughs> okay, so I can get, take you out. I can drive you here. I can take you wherever you want to go. Let's go out for the day. Let's go out for the night. Let's just let me come over and visit. Let me sit with you for a little while. You know, if you're struggling, let me come over. You know, but it will also be like me. I have just said... Okay, you get all of the parts, you do all of the legwork and the brain work of what I need to, uh, my car to be fixed, instead of me taking it up the garage. This will be your purpose. Put your head into it. You're really good with cars. Put your head into it, blah, blah, blah. Give you something to think about. Mentally stimulate yourself, okay? Then start to think, how much is it going to cost? Tell me how much is it's going to cost. And then we'll both do it. Okay, I'll be here, but you can do it because I know nothing about cars. Need four new brakes, four new brake discs. 
two sensors on the front of my wheels doing because <laughs> it goes beep beep anti anti brake system fucking ABS braking. Oh dear, amber green light, blue light, green light, right? But uh, or amber or amber leaves. Some of you smoke, okay, or Bailey or bailiffs might be like really struggling around money and finances at the moment. So you might be paying someone to fix something for you. I think it's always very good to do that. If you've got friends and people that are really struggling, is to if you can afford it, is to um, is to set them up with something. Is is to set them a goal. Is to set them a task. Okay, not say like here's loads of money. Let them earn it. Okay, it focuses them on. Okay, you know. And I was talking to this about my friend. You know, in order to build any kind of business or to build anything up, you know, you've really got to be looking at it in the terms of. While I'm practicing is when I'm actually learning my my skill and my craft. That's how I'm learning, is to do it on the job. I can't learn it just by watching. I have to do it. Okay, so I have to put the work in to get better at it. So during those first few years is when you're becoming really good at your art. And that is the time that you're building your business up. As you're building it up, you're actually learning as you go along, as you build it. Event because I'm a seven. I used to build houses for fuck's sake, <laughs> right? And also used to drive for a living. But like, uh, you can only like if you're if it's learning to drive and it's Corey Haim, okay. But like if it's learning to drive, you can't just get straight into a car and think, right? I know how to drive, <laughs> right? So, you know, you have to learn. You have to keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing it. If this is about giving someone something to do to focus on. It's always good to have a project of a car or something where like, okay, I'm going to have to have a break. I'm going to go and do what I enjoy the most, okay? I'm going to have to start, stop thinking about all this grief and all this shit, and I'm going to go out for a drive, or I'm going to get someone to do this for me. I can pay them for it, okay? Okay? So it might be something like that, but Chariot is always focus-driven, away from the energy of three, okay? To take the pain away, what can I do? Give someone a project, set them a task, Okay? One step at a time. Okay. So it might be where you're helping out friends, family, siblings, brothers, sisters. Okay. Uh, someone may not have a car and you're giving them lifts to work backwards and forwards to help them out. Okay. Because this could be a brother, a sister, a friend. Um, yeah, because I'm also hearing taking me to work. Because this is work. Putting someone to work or taking them to work. My friend is a Taurus. Putting them to work. Okay. But this can also be taking them to work. If they got work and they haven't got a car, you offer to take them to work. Okay, here. It's a good deed. Uh, where's your love life in this? I've got no idea, Pisces. So we're going to go on the other side and start the divulging. Uh, your love life may be coming up. But at the moment, uh, it seems like tasks. Taskmasters just master's degree or something like that and trying to master something craft it build it shape it you know make it better not worse okay so that's what we've got so some of this is your project um yes yeah, so if you want to join you can it's the full access bundle only uh, i'm going to clarify this side clarify this side give you more cards show you whatever it is that comes up here then i will look into the thoughts and feelings but thoughts and feelings Sometimes they're still coming across as people that are in your life. But if you're in relationships, sometimes it's different. And it means this is my love life and I'm in love. This is the situation of my story of friends and family and groups. So on and so forth. And sometimes it changes. But we have a look. Loads of different things over on Patreon. If you want to join, it's the full access bundle only. You can find that link provided below. Thanks very much, guys. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you on your next one.